Hello everyone, I'm Ramon. Welcome back to Ramona Home. I'm so excited you're here today because we're talking about flowers from Walmart and Dollar Tree. We all like flowers, but we do not want to pay the expense that it takes to buy fresh flowers. I really honestly think the fresh flowers should be safe for special occasions. Uh, so if you're going to have family over, you want to do a tablescape with fresh flowers, I think that it would be worth the investment. However, if it is just for decorating, then silk flowers will just do. And right now, Walmart has a great selection of 97 cent bushels so we're gonna go and check them out if you want to come with me please stay tuned if you're new to the channel here we talk about interior design and decorating through fun DIY projects like this so you can unleash your inner designer and create a space that tells your story so please consider subscribing all right you guys let's go shopping and we'll be back and talk about it you know, sometimes it's easy to forget that Walmart carries some of the best budget decorating items. They did a fabulous job for Christmas and I was there the other day and I saw that their spring floral picks for 97 cents. It was just spectacular. So right now we're going to head out to Walmart and check out their selection for floral picks because it is almost time to start preparing for a wreath making. So if we can get on a budget, why not? So let's head over to Walmart and see what they have and I'll show you in a second. Stay tuned. Okay, so then they have this really cute rose bush that comes with so many flowers. And as you guys can see, the quality is really greater. The flowers really hold their shape. I also love this one for wreath making. This gorgeous blue iris, you guys, is so realistic looking. And as you guys can see, the fabric or the silk really holds up on these ones. They're only 97 cents and the colors are real to life. I absolutely love this guy. Sometimes we need some queen lace or also some baby's breath in this pick for 97 cents. It's a really good filler. I really recommend it. It comes in like seven little uh, bushes or stems and I think they're absolutely perfect. Super cute blue delphinium. These are also pretty. They'd be so pretty on a jar with uh, a whole bunch of them because they're only 97 cents. They're perfect also for weight making. I absolutely love this one. This lilac is so realistic and I absolutely love it. Also 97 cents for like five stems of it. The color's also real to life. It's so cool. My favorite has to be this, uh, this beautiful coral and orange flower. It's absolutely beautiful. This is the kind of flower that I like to put on my wreaths because it really is a beautiful pop of color. They're only 97 cents for five flowers. And you know how popular this flower is this time of the year i love the cult now one of my favorite ones on the more expensive bushes is this bush of um fern i wish i can open it for you guys but this guy's only five dollars and it has so much product get yourself some of this fern for five bucks now i have to show you guys this bushel of ostromeria which is absolutely realistic looking you guys can see the speckles on it it's just so pretty and the color is so vibrant it's also perfect for wreath making or just having a whole bundle of it in a little jar so this bundle of tulips is only 97 cents and look at the quality of them they're very well shaped they're not floppy at all and it comes from this color variety so run to your local walmart and get some of you guys because we're gonna need them for wreath making they're absolutely gorgeous and these uh, ranunculus have to be one of my favorites as well they're so pretty looking there's two four six seven flowers in the bundle for 97 cents i mean does it get better while we are shopping at walmart for florals i decided to stop and look at their valentines because they have even more selection right now they have so many cute things you guys you have got to make a trip Okay, I have to stop and look at this cute little tic-tac-toe. It's so pretty. It is on the Valentine's selection. It's 6 dollars I absolutely love it. I think I need that in the house. Now that I don't need the rose gold, I'm seeing it everywhere. Like this beautiful heart. It is made out of kind of like a glitter. I wish I would have had this glitter for Christmas. Oh my gosh, and look at this red one right here. Oh, so pretty, you guys. Look how it sparkles. Here's another one. This would be just so cute on the door. Look 
how it sparkles so beautiful all right you guys so i am living in walmart and as you guys can see the flower selection is absolutely spectacular so now we're gonna head out to dollar tree and look at their florals so we can compare the quality and the price let's go All right, so I really love these yellow daisies. They are really full and look at the color variation. I think they're perfect for wreath making. As well as this lilac right here. It's a different type of lilac, but I like how vibrant it is. I think these two colors combined, it's very spring. This is also another one of my favorites. This is a really pretty pink and fuchsia a flower that I absolutely love. It's super full and it really holds its shape really well. I think this is a winner actually. Their daffodils here are not as pretty as I thought they would be. They're really already very in bad shape and I don't think they would hold up out on the sun if you put on the wreaths, maybe in a container. But I think this daffodil is definitely a no. Really pretty hydrangea bushels that I love. This pink hydrangea is also a really good filler for wreaths to cover that wreath form. It's only a dollar and I love the color. As you guys can see, it's very vibrant and kind of realistic looking actually as you guys can see the iris here at the dollar store is really bad shape compared to the one at walmart it doesn't really hold the shape as you can see right here so i think walmart really has a better iris than dollar tree i'm also not impressed with their tulips the fabric is really really thin as you guys can see if i separate it it doesn't hold the shape it's really floppy compared to walmart's are really really firm so this is also a no here at Dollar Tree. They have this really pretty magnolia actually for, for the price. It's really huge bloom of magnolia. There is three stems. And I think this is really cute to put on a container just sitting on a table. Not bad. And of course one thing I do love here is their spiky grass. This looks really realistic. You get a whole bunch of it for $1. And it also includes some flowers. I think they're all Stromeria, but not sure. Thanks so a goodbye. Now this peon is new this time around and I haven't seen it, but I do think the one at Walmart also shaped to better. I think the color is pretty, but for the dollar, then you get better quality at Walmart. Pretty color though. Overall, these flowers are good for like uh, cemetery work or something that you just don't want to spend a lot of money on. The flower selection is good. However, the quality I would have to give it to Walmart this time around. Although I also do like that delphinium right there. It's so pretty and long, but it's a dollar a stem. So I'll let you guys decide. But while you are here at Dollar Tree, I do encourage you to look at their wreath forms. They have it on grapevine and also metal and to their containers as well because they have a really good selection for a dollar. They can be repurposed. There's no need to spend more than that for a project. Okay, so this has to be one of my favorite things this year. This like hanging amaranthus. This is gonna be great for wreath making, you guys. If you see it in your store, get yourself some because we're gonna need some for some projects. Super cute. This is one of my favorites all time, a green hydrangea because it's a great filler and we're gonna be using a lot of it. So get yourself some. Well, as you guys can see the selection, a Walmart and Dollar Tree is great. There is a lot of differences between the 97 cent from Walmart and the dollar from the Dollar Tree. I really think that you have to go pick and choose because both of the stores have really great selection for really good prices. There's a few of the flowers that I like, like the lilac and the uh, peonies at Walmart, but then there's other ones that I like at Dollar Tree, like the grasses and other flowers that I love, like the delphinium. The long delphinium is just so pretty and it would be so beautiful in just one bundle of all tall delphinium. And I think I will actually do that for our spring home tour to show you guys that you do not have to spend a whole bunch of money on flowers. Now, don't get me wrong. I think the uh, flowers like this should be mixed with a little bit more upscale flowers like this to kind of, uh, pull the look together and not spend a whole bunch of money because if we put all Dollar Tree 
flowers in a wreath was gonna look like a Dollar Tree, but if we mix them together, you can cut the price in half and make it look gorgeous, which we'll get to doing very soon. We'll get to do some wreaths and some centerpieces and some things like that for spring, and I could not be more excited. All right, you guys, well, that's all I have for today. If you haven't seen the video where I talk about pillows and how to decorate with pillows, I'm gonna link it up right here so you can check it out and you can subscribe by clicking on the button somewhere right here. If you guys like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share with a friend. And if you're new to the channel, well, welcome. And don't forget to subscribe because we're gonna have plenty of videos like this daily here at Ramona Home. Thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, don't forget to leave me a comment down below and let me know what is your favorite flower. I really wanna know. Thank you guys, until next time, bye.